and Kathy, according to this, we're live. So, hey, everyone, it's Michael Creasy here, the executive editor with Agent Inner Circle from agentinnercircle.com, and I'm here to share with you a little bit about Service for Life. And you're saying, Michael, executive editor of Agent Inner Circle, what does that have to do with Service for Life? Well, dang good question, and here's the short answer. Agent Inner Circle actually owns Service for Life. And Service for Life has been around for over 20 years, and many, many of our customers that are using Service for Life are still the original ones from 20 years ago, 20 plus years ago. So if they're still paying their uh, annual subscription because it's not free, then it must be doing something right. And before you say, Michael, but this is print, print's dead, everything's on the internet. Yeah, well, we're going to dispel that myth. I've got someone on the call with me today, and she is a top selling agent with Keller Williams. She has her own team. She is a broker. So I thought rather than me tell you all the wonderful things about Service for Life, I would invite Kathy on with me today, and she would share her insights. So Kathy, welcome to the call. Thanks, Michael. Appreciate it. Um, so Kathy, tell us, first of all, tell us a little bit about yourself, like the company that you're with, your, your backstory, and because I want people to know that you're, you're credible, you're doing this day to day, and you're a professional realtor. Sure, no problem. I have been in the real estate business for approximately 32 years. I'm currently with Keller Williams Hometown Realty in Dayton, Ohio. I started my career with a small brokerage, um, and then I went into uh, a company called Heritage World Rose, which became Coldwell Banker. I've been through Remax, and I've landed at Keller, and I've been at Keller Williams for probably 15 years now. I am a broker. I do have a team of three. I'm in business with my husband, Michael, and I also have a buyer's agent, Vicki, and uh, we average about 75 transactions a year in our, in our market area. That's awesome. So, <laughs> you're Michael and me, Michael, are two different people. They're absolutely different people. My husband's last name is Klingler, not Kreisa. <laughs> there you go, but pretty close anyway after yes. the wash. So how did you, so let me ask you this, how many years ago was it when you stumbled across Service for Life? I actually was in a coaching program with Craig Ford and I began using Service for Life at its initiation. I have used Service for Life since the first issue came out. And it has been a gold mine for me. I mail it not only to potential clients, but also to past clients. And I also, I will tell you, I do use it on Facebook. Um, there are hits from the Facebook postings that we use, but I still do use the snail mail. I have a lot of elderly clients that don't use the internet. And oddly enough, even those that I think are using the internet, when I show up to a listing presentation, there's a copy of the Service for Life sitting on their table saying, We've kept this. You know, it's not all about real estate, which is which is the best thing about Service for Life. There's so much information in it. It's not all real estate related, and the clients absolutely love the trivia questions. So you've thrown so much at me, I don't even know where to start. So let's <laughs> let's unpack this a little bit. For those who don't know, Craig Fort was the founder of Service for Life, also the the founder of Agent Inner Circle. And uh, he wrote or put together this program, which is called Service for Life. Now, let me plant the seed into your head, the people that are watching right now. Imagine the most <clears throat> beautiful, glossy, full-colored newsletter you have ever seen. The paper is high quality, and the pictures literally leap out of the page. Service for Life is the complete opposite. It is would you agree, Kathy? It's got to be. I completely agree. I've used the slick, fancy, high color, all those newsletters in the past. I did until I discovered Service for Life, and I've never looked back. So let me ask you: when you, since you use the conventional, let's call. And let me go back a step. Service for Life, boys and girls, is basically a newsletter that is written with. It's not real estate content. And there's a part of your brain, it's called the reticular activator. And when things are important to you, let's say, Kathy, when was the last time you bought a car? About a year ago. What did you buy? I bought a Nissan Armada. A, a Nissan Ramada? Armada. Armada, okay. So before you bought the car, did you do your due diligence? You probably did a bit of searching online, different chat groups. You researched the car, correct? Absolutely. And just before you made that decision, yeah, this is the car, I know it's the one I want, did you suddenly notice that there were more of them on the road? Quite a bit, absolutely. I, I drove another vehicle for many, many years, of course, that's all I saw on the road at that point in time, but you're absolutely correct. 
once you got that focus on there, that's what you saw. Everywhere I drove, I saw an armada. <laughs> you think it was Nissan going, hmm, in their evil hatchery, tap is thinking about buying a car. We got to flood the market with those. Not at all. It was, it was the brain going, oh, there's one. Oh, there's one. <laughs> So the reticular activator is still part of our primitive brain. And what it does, it filters in all the bits and pieces of information that bombard us on a daily uh, basis. And it pulls out the ones that are important to us. So in that point in Kathy's life, buying that particular model of car was important. So it was top of mind. But here, I'm going to throw a curveball at you guys and gals. When you send out just listed, just sold, and all your other, I'm going to call it propaganda. When people have already bought a home, or they've sold a home, they've already been through the process and now they're settled in. The last thing they want is real estate stuff because their brain is not attuned to it right now. They don't care. But when you send them stuff about, oh, how to improve my credit score? How do I stop my cat from crapping on the living room carpet? That's <laughs> the kind of content that we put in service for life. It actually uh, titillates people. It engages them to read it. Kathy, am I going on too much or would you agree with that? I completely agree with that. All the articles each month are different. And again, they're not real estate related. As you said, it relates to some health issues or uh, a new website for uh, health and, like you said, health and wellness. It's all different. And that I think has actually proved to be its longevity. It's not all about real estate. It truly isn't. Now, the parts that are about real estate, because you're saying, well, Michael, if it's got nothing to do with real estate, why are they going to call me? Well, direct response copywriting or direct response marketing is a psychological type of marketing that actually gets people to engage with what they're watching or reading. And that's how Service for Life is put together. So throughout the newsletter, there are subtle little calls of action that get people to engage, to reach out and say, hey, Kathy, uh, I may have somebody that's interested in buying or selling. And it's very subtle, but very powerful. And uh, would you agree with that, Kathy? I completely agree with that. You, you do have the little, like you said, the little subliminal messages without the, throughout the newsletter. And it has worked. All I can tell you is, like I said, I've used this newsletter for over 20 years. And that's really, as far as marketing tools, this is the tool I use the most. Now, let me ask you this question, Kathy. We teach uh, agents that it's all about their power list or their sphere of influence. These are people that already know, like, and trust you. They've done a transaction with you. Uh, when they hear you, your name, Kathy, they think real estate, they know what you do. So you've got a database because I know you, if you've been in business for 20 years, you've got a database. When it comes to service for life, the power of a newsletter is not to send it out hilly nilly to anybody with a pulse because that is not going to serve you and you're going to make waste money. The focus is to get this into the hands of people that already know, like, and trust you. Correct. And that's exactly what we do. Our database, oh, we've, we've fine tuned it over the years, you know, add and subtract it as people have either moved out of the area, moved on or passed away. Um, so we, our email database is probably about 650. And as I say, we not only do we, our email database, those are our past clients, our sphere of influence, of course, the family members that we have. Um, but as I said, we do also share it on Facebook and we do pick up leads from Facebook. But truthfully, it, you're right, it's the past clients, our sphere of influence, that has made the most impact with Service for Life. So in terms of the direct mail, um, how big of a list are you direct mailing to? Currently, we're only mailing about a mm, hundred. And again, those are mostly elderly clients, but it still works. Um, and if they don't get the newsletter, Kathy, where's my newsletter? Yeah. <laughs> so, do you, do you find that they also, when they get the newsletter, they want to share it with friends and family and they call you to add them to the list? They absolutely do. As a matter of fact, I had a listing presentation last evening that I had sold a condo for the daughter. The daughter passed the newsletter on to the mom and I got the phone call to go out on the listing presentation. Wow. How cool. So it's, it's not only getting you business, but it's growing your database at the same time. Absolutely. Wow. 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 So the one thing, let me, let me bring this back. When you actually see a copy of service for life, as I said, picture glitzy Hollywood, this looks like, well, it looks like a realtor put it together. Literally it was designed in such a way that it looks like you slaved with your, you know, your computer using whatever software program to put it together. And that's Correct. what really makes this thing work. So um, what I want to share with the people that are on this call right now or listening, watching the video is don't think that the simplicity of this takes away from the power of it. And let me explain it this way. When you get into your car, it literally takes three steps. You put the key in, crank the ignition, put it in gear, press the gas, and you're gone. What you don't see 
is the thousands and thousands of bits and pieces in the background that create that simplicity so you can merrily be on your way driving your car. Service for life, when you look at it, you're gonna say, wow, this is so simple. But the simplicity covers up the professionals that have written it, the science and the psychology that go into producing it. So when you send it out, the simplicity is people do call you and respond. Correct. And it is very simple to use with the website that you have created. Uh, once you set up your basic information, your name, the website, and the tidbits that you ask us to set up, we insert the photo. It's very simple to use, set up either email or print, boom, go. It's extremely easy to use. Have you tried the new platform yet? We're in the process of doing that. We've transferred our database over into the, the new database format. And unfortunately, it probably carried over far too many of them. So I'm deleting the ones that shouldn't be emailed. We're about ready to send it out. I've almost combed through the list here. I should have it out here probably by the middle of next week. You are going to love this. Like I'm the first time Alex got it all together. Alex is my business partner, the CEO <laughs> of Agent Inner Circle. And, it, and the challenge was a knucklehead like me um, <laughs> could take service for life. Can we get it done? Like from taking the template and sent to the printer within 90 seconds. That was, oh, yes. the, that was the challenge. And literally within 90 seconds, I had the template already drawn up. All I had to do was answer a few simple questions. And for those, again, let me explain it to you. Within the newsletter, we create little calls to action. And one is um, a contest every year. I, I, I guess you use that in your edition. What, what is it that you give away as a prize, Kathy? Oh, it, it varies from month to month. You know, sometimes it's a gift card to Starbucks. Sometimes it's Amazon. Sometimes it's the local grocery store uh, or, you know, kind of some of the local shops, particularly because most of what we do is local, very localized um, target marketing, if you will. We've actually even uh, given gift certificates to some of the local vendors here in town, which is kind of nice. From and do you find people are actually trying to answer the question, the win? Oh, my gosh. I have two little ladies that want to be the first one answering that question, thinking they're going to, no matter what, they're gonna, if they're first, they're going to win. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Um, if I was a skeptical real estate agent, Kathy, what would you say to me about Service for Life? I was skeptical at one point in time also. Like I said, I did use the slick color marketing pieces in the past and having used this product for 20 some years, you're crazy not to use it. Honestly, it, feel free to call me, ask me the questions. I have used it. I religiously use it. It goes out every month and it's been a gold mine for us. It doesn't get nicer than that, Kathy. That there's actually <laughs> tears coming down my cheeks here. You can't see the. Oh, I can't wipe them off your face, Michael. <laughs> <laughs> it's deflecting it here. There, there was something else I want. Oh, have have you ever? So one of the strategies that we teach agents is how to get service for life paid for by leveraging huh? your not your sphere of influence, but let, let's call it your community partners, your business partners. Have you done that at all in the past? I have done that in the past, where I've had movers and title companies, uh, different vendors. And there's, there's a second page, the cover, cover letter page that we have used. We've actually we've put them on the back as far as the vendors on the back of that cover letter page to promote their businesses too. So yes, we have done that in the past to get it paid for. Absolutely. So let me explain that to you guys and gals that are watching this. Um, we teach you how to actually leverage the context that you have with maybe it's your local chiropractor or dog groomer or grocery store, whatever that is. And we've created a template that you can use to now help to uh, promote these businesses within Service for Life. And they'll gladly in exchange pay for the privilege of doing this, which will offset your costs for doing service for life. Now, when I say we, we teach you how, again, within service for life, we've got a vested interest in you being successful. And let, let me just put my cards on the table here. If you're getting leads and those leads are turning into sales and listings, that means you're going to be so thrilled with service for life. You're going to keep renewing your subscription. There it is. I'm putting it out there on the table. We're in the business to make money. You do one transaction. That's literally enough to pay for service for life for eight years. <laughs> Kathy's been using this for 20. So when I say we teach you, we have a whole course in play that when you sign up for Service for Life, we literally take you by the hand, step by step, and show you all the different ways that you can leverage this to make business. Uh, Kathy, is that fair to say? It's very fair to say. And I will tell you, it don't, you know, the first month, it, you may not see a whole lot of people responding because they're going to go, hmm, what? Like anything, it takes a repetition. So after about the fourth or fifth month, that newsletter just, it went, it went gangbusters. It, there's a little bit of investment on the front end, but it, the payoff is phenomenal. Now, let me ask you this part. If you ever run into difficulty, if you've ever had issues, what's our customer service like or customer support? 
Wonderful. I've never had an issue. They're always there to answer any question I've ever had. Yeah, our customer service staff, um, they're, they're awesome. The two that come to mind right now, Brandy and Alana, are you couldn't ask for nicer people, <clears throat> excuse me, and they'll literally walk you through any issue that you've got. I don't know what else to say, Kathy. Am I missing anything here? Not at all, except they're missing the boat if they're not using Service for Life. It is a phenomenal tool. Kathy, let's do another plug from you one more time. Who are you with and where are you from? Kathy McGrail. I'm with Keller Williams Hometown Realty in Dayton, Ohio. Kathy, it's been a pleasure uh, speaking with you today. Thank you so much for sharing so openly what uh, your experience has been with Service for Life and continued success. And if there's anything you ever need or what we can do to help you out, you know where I am. Thanks. I appreciate it. Thank you, Kathy. Thank you.